Hey guys, Chaos Kaiser here, and this is my PHP tutorial. First off, before we get started, I just like to use Crimson Editor, uh, completely free. So if you're using like plain old Windows Notepad or something like that or WordPad, lame. Get this, it's completely free. Uh, if you've got money, there's plenty of syntax editors out there that you can get. Uh, I think Notepad++ is pretty good, or at least I've heard that. Uh, anyways, on to the tutorial. Um, we'll be showing you how to make multiple pages in the same file. This, In order to do this, first of all, we're going to be using file.php for a file name. Meaning, you'll find this is your main URL. In order to make a new page, you must have this bit added on. Um, if you have something else like that, you need to have an ampersand, uh, and symbol, in between it. But if not, just a regular old question mark. Okay, first of all, now, uh, the, that and that must always match because you're using a regular hard-coded uh, PHP variable, uh, get, you can, there's other things for forms, uh, another one for form called post, uh, but that doesn't work on URL variable, whatever. Okay, this is an old variable. You can name, name it whatever you want, it does not have to match this. In fact, this can be named whatever you want as long as it matches it in here. Okay, now, there are three ways that I know of that are really easy in order to make more than one page. There's separate if statements, if else if statements, and if else statements. First of all, this one, I do not suggest using it if you're going to have three or more pages. It's designed to be either page one or page two, no matter what. Okay. Basically, you've got your conditional statement. If op equals page one, then show the page one data. Okay. Then close it off. Now for page two. If op equals page two, show the page two data. Simple, easy. Uh, for the if, else if, the only thing different is instead of typing if, if, you're doing if, and then when you close it off, you're typing else if, and putting the new conditions in there. And that could be the same way, that can even be used in such a way like this. So you can add more pages. See? Or, if you want three pages that could be used like this, I messed it up, it could be used like that, see? Just remember, you have to close off basic syntax rules. Okay, and then same thing, except instead of else if or separate if statements, you're doing a regular else. Pretty simple. Right? Okay, well, I guess <laughs> that pretty much sums this tutorial up. Uh, comments, whatever you want to see me give you a tutorial of, comment. Uh, I'm not going to ask you to subscribe, because honestly, I don't think I'm really going to get any, am I? It doesn't matter to me. Subscribe if you want to, I don't really think it matters. And, bye. I...